Okay, I will say this. Tis the season. <laughs> um, this area, Sam Rester Terrapin, in Carolina, is, and I do a lot of work on these guys every year, and it is now officially springtime. I think we're a few weeks into it. They're already getting uh, my first maggot case. There's actually a few maggots in this pocket here. You notice know, over top of this neck here, there's quite a few maggots in that area as well. So our mission is to go ahead and move these. Um, the powers that be, our, our official animal counters and stuff in Jackson. There you go, buddy. Just making sure you're a little bit more centrally located on your on your restraint device. <laughs> Turtle says, one love, all right. <laughs> anyway, it turns out that our animal counters uh, in uh, mid to north Jackson do not know that the turtles down here actually have these maggot problems. So last year, um, with the help of a client, we actually had raised some on some meat and took them out of one of these turtles. We uh, then had raised the maggots up into flies and took the flies off the speciated. And of course, they didn't believe it was still a problem. It's just a rare thing. These sarcophagid flies just don't do this. And I'm like, look. I've been doing this for 18 years, and for 18 years, we've had the same problems all over again. Can I get that look on the camera? No, no? Can't, all right. Sorry. It's a waste of a good look. Um, <laughs> anyway, so this year, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to grow me some maggots. So there is our maggot container, um, and I'm going to go set up a special place to keep these things, and we're going to raise them up, and I'm going to do this with several turtles this year. I'm going to be like Maggot Daddy. I'll be, bringing, no, I'll, be, bring, I'll be bringing in little cigars. Look, I'm a daddy again. <laughs> so anyway, um, we're going to do this again this year. And this time we're going to document it a little bit more scientifically. And do this with several of my patients. And so at this point in time... This guy is, well, I'll think of some official designation for him in just a second. In the meantime, I'm going to go ahead and sedate this guy. So this is what it looks like when he's alive on the restraint device. Hopefully in a minute, hit, the next time you focus in on this guy, you'll see his head kind of bobbing and looking down and his legs relaxed, kind of like they are now. All right, that's my prediction. Later. You happy now? Let's go. Because we're actioning. All right. There's the hole in the head. Where did my three go? This pocket here goes all the way back around this spot here. So all these are maggots. I'm guessing about 20. And of course, in here, there's probably going to be about three or four. Um, and then now that he's sedated, we get a chance. I did forget to mention earlier that his uh, right rear leg is rather necrotic and needs to be amputated. So we'll go ahead and we'll fix that up as well. What are you doing? Oh, you're being a demonstrator? Okay. Thank you, Vanna, for showing us the beef jerky that he calls a leg. <coughs> okay, good? All right, I'll turn around right now. All right, so I'm going to hand her the camera, and I'm going to start picking maggots. Woohoo! Oh, my fingers are in the back. Here, can you take this one? Oh, got two at once. Yeah, it's a good day fishing when you make that happen. <laughs> you know, BB, you're awfully quiet back there. Two again! Woohoo! Are you still counting? Sixteen. Hit 
here. It's shrinking. Twenty. I can't do that right. I just doesn't. I don't do that lucky. What about over there? Huh? Over. Over there. Over there. There might be. Oh, there it is. 21. 21. <laughs> I knew it. Yeah, oh yeah, you knew it. Whatever. Hey, I was I did pretty good. I knew you would you say? Because I'm always wrong? Yeah. Okay. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I thought they were bigger. I mean, smaller, excuse me, that's what I thought. Alright, that will shrink up over time. No more holes over there. No more holes over here. Turn it there. Give me some uh, quercetin four by fours. Let this soak for a bit before I start cutting this stuff off. Okay, goodbye. All right, even after the last installment of the video, we actually did find another one in here, um, but the leg has been amputated. Turn this guy around. And there's a suture line in there. It actually taking it off right at the, uh, the hip joint. That is probably my wife. So let me answer that. Okay, so that wasn't my wife. It was one of my man crushes. <laughs> Doug will be in here in a minute. <laughs> to pick this guy up. That's okay. Speak, woman. No. All right, we're not going to say anything. Okay, so anyway, they're going to pick up the turtle any second now. So I'm going to put this guy while he's still sedated into his box, and he will be given a home. Later.